Hey, what is up, guys? It's Logos and the Fire Friend. Today, we are talking Star Wars Rogue One yet again. And we have two topic hands today. The first of which is being a new original trilogy character being rumored for the film. And also, when could we see the first official trailer drop for Star Wars Rogue One? Now, of course, that first topic is going to be related to the character of Boba Fett, the most dangerous bounty in the galaxy. And rumors swirling around that he may be appearing in Rogue One. Now it's already confirmed that Darth Vader will have a pretty sizable role in Rogue One. And it's now adding fuel to the fire when we talk about Boba Fett. Boba Fett was one of the bounty hunters hired by Darth Vader in Episode 5 to hunt down the Rebel crew. Especially Han Solo. As Han Solo was the ta main target of Boba Fett because of Jabba the Hutt. Now when you talk about him being in Rogue One... The reason these rumors are swirling around because at the Nuremberg Toy Fair, there was a Lego set for Rogue One in which there was the Slave One, which is the ship owned by Boba Fett, previously owned by Jango Fett. Now, I'm not saying that this is a confirmation that Boba Fett will be in the film, because this could simply be a case of somebody owning a ship of the similar variety of the Slave One. It doesn't mean that that is his ship. Just, it could be a ship of the same class, as that was seen in Episode 2, when there were like three or four five millennial falcons on Naboo when Anakin and Padme went there for her protection. So not a hundred percent kind of confirmation that Boba Fett is in the film, but it definitely leaves, you know, a possibility that Boba Fett could be appearing in Star Wars Rogue One. Now we're getting to the topic about the first trailer appealing. Now the rumor is that the first trailer for Star Wars Rogue One, the first official trailer, will be dropped during Super Bowl 50 as one of the commercials. Now, this would be no surprise to me if it is dropped because that will be garnering a large audience because Super Bowl 50 draws some of the largest audiences in TV history. As a matter of fact, I think Super Bowl 49 was one of the most watched Super Bowls in history, if not one of the most watched television programs in history. So, it will be definitely reaching a huge audience and it'll definitely be catching the fuel that the Force Awakens left. So definitely wouldn't be a huge surprise if the first Rogue One trailer drops during Super Bowl 50. But if it does, be sure to stay tuned around this guild as I'll be breaking down that trailer. Looking at some of the biggest moments and some of my favorite moments from that trailer. But that's going to be it for today's video guys. Be sure to tell me down in the comment section down below. First, what do you think about Boba Fett appearing in Star Wars Rogue One? And second, what do you think about the possibility of the Star Wars Rogue One trailer dropping during Super Bowl 50? Leave me all your thoughts down in the comment section down below. Be sure to leave a like on this video, guys, if you enjoyed. Share it with all your friends. And be sure to subscribe to us Guild for the latest and greatest Star Wars content on YouTube. Until next time, this has been Logos and 5, one more Guild, and I'll definitely see you guys in a later video.